events where you live for one day only. You can journey through India without even stepping foot out of South Carolina. The sights, sounds, and smells of Indian culture will be coming to the Low Country at the third annual India Fest. Now, Dr. Joyce Minion, Minion with the Indian Association of Charleston is here to tell us what you can look forward to. How are you? I'm doing fine. Good, Thank you for good. having me on the show. Thank you. Talk a little bit about the festival. Yes, it is an admission free event mm -hmm. and you get to see very good quality free entertainment. Mm -hmm. There's lots of food vendors selling good Indian food like chicken tandoori, mm -hmm. samosas, chicken biryanis. And we have um, the usual henna artists mm -hmm. on site. We have free sari draping mm -hmm. and we have handicrafts, we have jewelry and we have, you know, lots of fun filled colorful entertainment. Now what's different this year from oh, previous? Oh yes, I would love to talk about that. The one thing which really, really excites me is the food cooking demonstration show. Mm. Now this is a special limited seating event and what we do here is the seasoned chefs from within uh, the Indian community mm -hmm. will share their secret recipes with you and then you get to eat a bite of what has been cooked. So it's a win-win mm -hmm. situation. Mm -hmm. And we have three sessions. We have an appetizer session mm -hmm. where we, you'll, they'll show you how to cook three appetizers, an entree session, and also a high tea session where they'll serve snacks with ginger tea, ginger chai, and masala chai. And I'm sure Excellent. you don't get that at the local Starbucks. I'm sure not. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. Now, you definitely have to get out there for this and uh, get out. There's more information on the screen. Again, India Fest is this Sunday, October 2nd at Marion Square in downtown Charleston. Stay with us.